to our van tour. We're gonna to take you on a tour today of this conversion van that we live in 24 seven. So this is where I live. It's my beautiful rent seat. Totally comfortable, always wonderful. So since this is an older van, we've got all the cool new gadgets, but they all come with cords. So we have a nice set of cords here for all of our things. GPS, dash cam, iPhone chargers, an aux cord for the music. We have this nice center console filled of all of the things that we might need on our trip. Over on my side of the town, I have my steering wheel, my phone, and my GPS, and I just hang out here for a couple hours at a time while we drive to whatever our next place is gonna be. And here we've got the kitchen. It's so spacious. It's the kitchen, but it also sort of doubles as the bathroom. We've got a little toilet here. We've actually never used it. Another really cool aspect about this van is we have a sink, and it actually has running water. So we have this control panel here that has all of the switches for the different electrical things that we use, such as the fresh water pump. So we just fill it up with water, flip on the switch, and we're good to go. We also have switches for the cabin lights, for the fan, for the fridge, and also for any of the outlets that we might need to use to charge things. Speaking of fan, we have this vent right here that opens up to the outside and the fan can turn on so we can get some fresh air. So we have this nice swivel desk right here. It can move wherever you need it to be. It's really great to use as a kitchen surface when we're cooking or as a work surface while we're sitting here or as a nightstand, a little bedside table for the nighttime. Okay, now don't judge me because we're living in a van and it's kind of tricky, but here is our pantry. You can see it's a little bit disorganized. Everything's just kind of thrown in there, but that's what happens when you live in a van. So one thing about living in a van full time is that you don't have a certain place for everything that you own. For example, all of our bedding is just hanging out right here on the couch because there's not really any place to put it. It may not look very pretty, but it's functional. So we've got these really fun like turquoise blues, I guess maybe sea foam green cabinets here that open up where we've got all of our clothing. And this is our garage. Really exciting, you guys. We've got a, a toolbox and that's about it because not a lot fits right there. When you're ready to go to sleep at night, it's super easy to turn your couch into a bed. Boom, wasn't that easy? Not that we're gonna be using it anytime soon in this weather, but we have a shower. It has a little shower head that hooks right here, connects to a water tank and has a pump connected. And we put up just a little curtain right here and then you can shower in peace. On top of the van, we have a couple solar panels. So that's what charges everything up and it stores it into a battery. And then we can use that to run the refrigerator, the lights, laptops, or whatever it is overnight as well. So we can still have power. Lastly, we also have a safe in the van. So if we're ever gonna be leaving some valuables, we can put them in the safe, feel confident that nothing's gonna happen to them. So this is our van. This is where we live 24 seven. It's our home sweet home on the road. It may be small and definitely has its quirks, but so far it's been a really fun place for us to explore the country in.